Hey everybody, I'm Crazy Captain 42 and welcome to Trivia Time. Today I'm going to talk about the GS Ball for Pokemon. So without further ado, let's get on with the show. In the actual Pokemon games, the GS Ball is an event item in the Japanese version of the Gen 2 games that can be taken to Ilix Forest to get a Celebi. However, in the anime, the GS Ball plays a different role, which is what I'm going to go over in this episode. In the anime, the GS Ball started off in the possession of Professor Ivy, who couldn't figure out how to open it. So she wanted to give it to Professor Oak to see if he could open it. So Oak sent Ash and Co. off to the Orange Islands to retrieve the GS Ball. So Ash retrieves the GS Ball from Professor Ivy, but instead of going back to Oak like he's supposed to, he decides to participate in the Orange League because that's clearly more important. After winning the Orange League, Ash gives the GS Ball back to Professor Oak. But then it's stolen by Team Rocket. But they get it back. Professor Oak is unable to open the GS Ball as well, so he gives it back to Ash and Co. and asks them to take it to Kurt, a Pokeball blacksmith in the Johto region, which gives Ash a reason to participate in the Johto League. On the way to Kurt, the GS Ball is stolen by a Quagsire, but Ash and friends are able to get it back. Ash and friends then arrive in Azalea Town and finally give the GS Ball to Kurt, and then it's never seen or mentioned again. So you're probably wondering, so Ash and friends went through all that, had the GS Ball stolen from twice, and they did that for nothing. What is the deal with the GS Ball? Well, in an interview with Master Mitsu Hidaka, he explained that the GS Ball contained a Celebi, and was going to be part of a big story arc in the Johto Saga. But then it was decided that Celebi would be the star of the fourth Pokemon movie, so that made the story arc pretty redundant, so the GS Ball was left in the hands of Kurt, hoping that the viewers would forget about it. But they didn't. To be honest, I don't know why they just didn't include the GS Ball in the movie. It would have fixed everything. But oh well, that's all in the past. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I've been Crazy Guy 42 I'll see you all next time on Trivia Time. Hey guys, if you liked the video, give it a big old thumbs up. And if you want to see some more Pokemon related videos, click on the thumbnails on the screen.